meteorologist Nick Jansen. High temperatures today across southeast Minnesota, northeast Iowa, some upper 70s, a couple places getting into the lower 80s. We've just been enjoying some sunshine here uh, this evening. Beautiful sunset tonight, and then uh, we have uh, something cool happening overnight. We'll talk about that here in a second. 75 outside, wind out of the southeast at 5 miles per hour, dew points in the mid 50s. Temperatures locally still some upper 70s, no 80s uh, right now. Austin was able to get up to 80 degrees for the high today. Now it's 79. It's 78 in Mason City, 77 in Albert Lee. Again, clear sky continues across the upper Midwest. High pressure overhead. That's in lock, especially in the upper Midwest. That uh, in and into the upper atmosphere that will lead to all those warm temperatures that went Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. And next week, those upper 80s and low 90s due to that high pressure. So as we look what to expect tonight and into tomorrow, we'll have some clear skies. We'll have some sunshine tomorrow, mild throughout the day on Thursday. This weekend, breezy, hot and humid. I think high temperatures could easily make it back into the mid 90s coming up by probably Sunday and Monday for Labor Day. Next week, above average temperatures, and that probably continues Monday all the way through about Friday. We're looking at above average temperatures. So uh, August ending somewhat cool, September a little different. Now, temperatures tonight will feel kind of fallish outside. Watch temperatures down into the low 50s here tonight. So a little brisk tomorrow morning, waking up by 8 o'clock in the morning. We're in the mid 70s. We will warm nicely tomorrow. Close to seasonal averages probably be in the upper 70s and some lower 80s. We'll pick up some stronger wind out of the south by Friday. Watch temperatures here throughout the day on Friday back into maybe the mid 80s for highs. That's just kind of a little teaser for what will come this upcoming weekend where we're back into the 90s, probably looking Saturday, Sunday and into Monday. One thing we didn't see in future track, the rainfall. We are dry Thursday all the way through Monday, maybe working in a straight chance late Tuesday, isolated chance on Wednesday. That's still looking six to seven days out. So we'll wrap up the month of August here tomorrow. We're dry both tonight and tomorrow. So we'll end the month at RST again. That's where official records are kept for the National Weather Service. So officially at RST 1.51 inches of rainfall for this month. We were 2.61 inches below average. Our wettest day of the month, August 11th at uh, 68 one hundredths. Meteorological summer comes to an end too as we move into September this weekend here. So that means June, July, August will end those three months for meteorological summer with 5.03 inches of rainfall. And notice our deficit, our departure from average. We are well over eight and a half inches below average for meteorological summer, and our drought could easily continue into the next month. Temperatures here tonight, 52 for the overnight low. Maybe a couple of us getting close to around the upper 40s. Tonight, something cool and we'll have great viewing. Clear sky here tonight. Uh, we have the blue super moon. Now, the blue moon means it's the second full moon of the calendar month, so the second full moon of August. But it's also a super moon, which means it appears 14% brighter here tonight. It's also the brightest and largest moon that we'll have this calendar year. The last time this happened where we had a blue super moon was all the way back in 2009 in December. The next time it'll happen is in 2037. So take advantage of the blue super moon here tonight. 78 for the afternoon high tomorrow. We'll have some low 80s in some spots. Garden gallery, garden gallery winner here. We have John uh, from Northwest Rochester. Thanks for sending that and win a $10 gift card to sergeants on second. Seven day forecast. I hinted at those hot temperatures this week at 91 for the high Saturday, 94 on Sunday. Low 90s continue Monday and Tuesday in the next week. Julian.